He sings in a language no one else can speak. Of geese roaming the skies and lagoons. His song rises from a rooftop in Santiago, the bustling Chilean capital where he grew up. Far from the lands to the south, the stark plains at the end of the earth. A land of nomads, Selknam Indians, early hunter-gatherers who were the undisputed masters of the cold prairies and mountains at the tip of South America. Cayuc is 25 years old. He claims Tierra del Fuego in his blood. Half Selknam on his mother's side, he wants to keep that ancient culture alive. To preserve what little is left of a once thriving people. The Selknam virtually disappeared towards the end of the 19th century. European traders colonized their lands. Sheep growers came to dominate the region. The Selknam were pushed out, most of them killed in violent acts of genocide. <laughs> A small cultural center in the town of Rio Grande, Argentina, serves as one of the last strongholds of the culture. Less than a dozen descendants of the Selknam still gather to draw strength. Language is one of the only things they have left. And Gayuk is the only one who speaks it. He learned it from an old woman before she died. Sin embargo, también tengo esperanza porque el ser humano es tan terco, es tan terco, eh, es tan cerrado, también tan hermético, que hay y veo un renacer. And in a way, it keeps the Selknam alive. If you like what you just saw, follow us on social media and visit our website, cctv-america.com.